Hello everyone, I hope you're doing beautifully well. We've got a question that's just come in and I thought I'd better look at it. It's from a not so valued viewer known as Tom Law, publicly subscribed to us for one year now. That's one year of commitment, RC. That's what we like to see in our beautiful men. 15 hours ago, Good. Cap, can a, a Tomcat or a green buttonmobile carry a launch with a moderate payload with, with one engine? To begin with, I was about to delete this, A, because it's Tom Law, and B, because I just thought I was just asking stupid stuff. It's actually a really good question. What if, and I'm sure this has happened before, I just haven't looked into it, you know, properly. What if a Tomcat launches and the catapult launches, and as soon as the catapult launches, you get an engine stall? I bet that's happened in an alpha version before. Or an F-18 sucks in an albatross and loses an engine. I bet that's happened. And, you know, it'll probably have some sort of payload, not necessarily a massively heavy payload, but it'll have a moderate payload. What happens to the fighter? I mean, what what's your... I haven't got the fog here, so we'll go and test it, obviously, but your opinion? I don't think they can save it. Well, I think the F-14 is going to die. We've got the F-14 Bravo, which has an asymmetric thrust limiter which stops the live engine from going on afterburner so that it doesn't twist and yaw into an uncontrollable spin, which means it won't spin, but the problem is it won't have very much, well, almost no power. It'll have mill power from one engine. What's that, like 15,000 pounds or something? To get right. 25 tonnes from basically stall speed up to cruise speed. I don't... Well, we'll see. I suppose if you jettison your stores, as soon as the you know the engine's off, that's one thing. We're allowed to do that, I think. That would be a reason to hit the Admiral's doorbell. F-18, yeah. I really don't know the rules of the F-18 in terms of if you lose an engine, do you have an asymmetric limiter? I don't think you do. Also, the, the you know, your is not such a big problem with the F-18 because you've got A, FCS, and B, the engines just aren't that far apart and they're not that powerful anyway. So it's really going to be an F-14 problem. Valid viewers have just found this. What's it like to fly an F-14 Tomcat with just one engine? Exactly the same thing happened. The catapult damaged one of the engines on an F-14A with the TF-30 engines, the nasty ones. So this is literally what happened here. And it survived, which is interesting. So I'm not going to read through the whole lot because it's just too much to read through for today. But it is survivable IRL. Okay, valid viewers, I'm just hooking up here in, in our Tomcats. So I'll see what... Oh, hang on, I've got to do things. Uh, we're going to cut an engine to idle just as the catapult goes, okay? Is this one going to go forward? Yep. I'm coming, baby. Make sure you've got your thrust limiter on, your asymmetric limiter on, because that would be on the standard. Um, let me yeah. just get myself configured for actual takeoff. Flaps down. Oh, our loadout is full fuel. Sidewinder, sparrows, two AMRAMs, and two bags. So two phoenixes. Uh, yeah, two phoenixes, two bags. So typical, relatively long range uh, air to air loadout. So are you going burner or no burner? Uh, what would a real Tomcat do? I've seen real Tomcats no with burn. burner on. Well, you do no burner. I'll do burner, and we'll see if it makes any difference. You go yeah. first, in fact. Okay, now they are letting you go. Yeah. Both the engine guys have to confirm no, the engines are going. The okay, let's see if the... Yeah, they got fooled us, so you fooled them. Yeah! Right, one engine mill power. Oh, 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 oh! oh you dead. Your pilots didn't get out either in time because of the stupid they delay. Tried. Okay, right. And it wasn't a power problem really it was only your problem wasn't it just what we thought yeah. it, it, you just can't beat that your because the engines are so far apart and they're so powerful even on mill power they just yaw you over you depart and that's the end of it i'm going to try it with afterburner and this will probably be even worse i'm going to go full burner on both and then i'm going to cut one engine as soon as the catapult grabs me i'm just going to react as i would normally react i'm going to do everything i can to try and save this left engine down your other engine stopped burning. Yeah, of course, AC battery limiter. Okay, I've got it. I've got it. I've got it. I, I managed it fine. I don't know what your problem was, RC. I yeah. got on that rudder. I detected it straight away, and I just wanged that rudder yeah. right off. I don't think I got on the rudder. Quickly. Yeah, so, so I mean, it's hard because you've got to... Actually, I'm struggling for speed. I don't know if I'm going to stall or not. Okay, Admiral's doorbell. I've got problem. Gear. Gear up. Flaps up. Yeah, I can make it. Beautiful thing about this Tomcat, so much lift, so much power. Yeah. 
the crease and I can go down the land. We've already done landing with one engine. We've got another video on that. So you can, because basically what m my, me and RC did was the same thing there. We both ended up with mil power, one engine, because of the asymmetric thrust limiter on this aircraft. Here, valued viewers, we're trying in the green button now. This just, I don't think this has an asymmetric thrust limiter, question mark, RC, any idea? I don't think it would need yeah. one. So this will allow us to have a burner on one engine, basically, which I don't think, um, I think this one will breeze it, to be honest, but we'll see. Right, uh, I think that's been ready to go. Flaps are just, I leave them like normal, don't I? Right, I'll see, I am going to go first this time. I've got my wings out, I'm going to go full burn. I've got a moderate load out, I forgot to show you, but I'll show you in a second. Left engine cut. It's just like normal, you don't even feel anything normal. It's just, yeah, it's fine, I'll see. You don't even, you don't even need to, to put your gear in, it just flies perfectly normally. Right, but that was a, that was an easy, super easy, so I'm going to punch out of that and watch I'll see. Come on, use that rudder, RC, use the rudder! He's got it! Super powerful monster car, Mobile. Well done. <laughs> he didn't even need to do that. He just wanted to give away $18 million worth of food. Right. Summarize, green button Mobile doesn't even notice any difference if it's got one engine on. As we thought, engines are powerful. Well, not that powerful, but they're close together and it's a light plane. The Tomcat had a lift, but it just pushed itself into a row, uh, into a yaw spin, if you don't get on the rudder quick enough. I got on the rudder quick enough and cancelled it. RC didn't get on the rudder quick enough and dished it, really. Um, so we've got to say, anything you want to add to that RC? I'll take that as a note. Bye-bye.